Hey, it's Mike Sorg at Sorgatron on the Twitter for basic Sorgonomics over at Sorgatron.com, a part of Sorgatron Media, which will be a thing. Uh, anyways, uh, so PodCamp Pittsburgh is this weekend. PodCamp Pittsburgh X. Got to make the arm note um, X. And, uh, and, and I'm looking forward to it. It's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, so... Uh, Again, it, it, it's, uh, it, geez, where do I start with this? Uh, one, I hope you're coming. If you're not, it's supposed to be streaming live. Go to podcampispberg.com for details over the weekend. And uh, there'll be links to, uh, I think there's going to be some Google Hangouts involved in that, some YouTube live action going on. Uh, so please, please go go check that out. Uh, it's going to be a lot of fun. Uh, we are... Um, well, we're almost there. We're almost there in general. If you're not going, if you're in the Pittsburgh area and you don't, you're not busy this weekend, I recommend coming down. We we have a lot of stuff going on. Um, it, it's an event that I'm 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 very much excited about year after year. And uh, I've been going. This is the tenth iteration, and I'm still looking forward to what I'm going to learn there. Uh, a couple years ago, uh, somebody once told me, and, and they haven't gone back since, I said, I don't go anymore because there's nothing more for me to learn, which I think is a complete BS answer to something like this. If you're in this space and you're in a creative space, how many times have we talked about um, on this show about growing? Uh, we just I just recorded a show last night for Fishing Without Bait about neuroplasticity and, and kind of growing your 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 ideas kind of growing your 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 skill set and especially as rapidly as all of these things are changing you know i talked about two new apps that might be worthwhile for you last week here on this show uh in in the case of beam and uh blab.im and uh it, it's just you know you 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 don't <sighs> You don't learn by just kind of sitting there and doing your own thing. You got to see at a certain point how other people are doing things. There's so many sessions on here about podcasting uh, from people that I didn't know were podcasters. Uh, you know, it, it's so interesting because we're in a small town of Pittsburgh, and 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 myself and my fellow podcasters we've known for for ten years are, are like what. Where are the other Pittsburgh podcasters? And then they crop out for something like this. I was looking at a session and, and kind of helping them with their logistics, and I'm like, I've never heard of this this cast before. Uh, we're all in our bubble, and we're all in our bubble of doing things. And, and you would be amazed. Some of the most influential things I've done to grow my audience over the last several years around my shows is from stuff that I've learned here. You know, and I've been a presenter since day one of PodCamp Pittsburgh, and it, 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 that doesn't mean I know everything. And if you think you know everything, then you're not going to learn anything new. You're not going to grow. And uh, I think I think that's really important. And, and and looking at events like this, and if not PodCamp, if not in your area, I mean, there are plenty of learning events. Go to Meetup.com, find stuff around that topic you want to know more about. There's a lot out there, or ask for it, or find forums, something like that. You have to grow. You have to learn you have to push that push that out basically um and and pod camps are really I, i'm really glad to see that the uh meet and greets and the uh and the mixers have kind of come together because i think that's where a lot of the magic happens after everybody's been flooded with information i know a lot of times about halfway through day two as a as more as a um as a as a viewer uh to these things you know, I, I would sit there and my mind would be mesh because I've, I've just taken in so much information. And, and, and in my head, I'm just like, what? I can't. No, we can't do anymore. <laughs> but uh, but uh, this this year, you know, uh, I think we've it's been uh, kind of pared down a little bit. There's only three rooms running at a time. We've had as many as like five or six in the past. And it's just and and and, and I'm the poor guy that decided that we're going to record the entire thing, uh, running around, making sure that happens. Happens. Uh, thankfully, that's been kind of uh, pared down a little bit as well, and uh, and we're going to get a little bit of help with the streaming uh, as well from uh, from our friends from Pixel Cores. Or I'm sorry, Saturday is it with our friends from uh, Pixel Cores as well. So one last thing I get to do. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, so, um, but again, really looking forward to it. Um, I kind of uh, uh, had a little fun on the on the Twitter the other day, and I and I put your uh, three checklists items for this weekend if you're looking to join us one make sure you're registered 
so we know how many people are coming. We can plan accordingly. It's nice to know. Uh, and and I know at least for the meet and greet, I think you get uh, spiffy name tags. And uh, but if you go in here, uh, number two, look at your sessions. Uh, what do you what do you want to see? There's a lot of decision making that needs to happen because there is a lot of great conflicting um, sessions head to head a lot of times so and, and again we're recording everything it'll be on google hangout you can go on the youtube later and, and kind of see what you missed in that session too um am i ready to make new friends i mean one of the big things was uh early on you know make sure you have business cards i you know it seems kind of weird but it is a networking event too a lot of the great connections and everything happen in the hallways of this event you know happen at the mixtures at this event that's where projects start and if you're ready for something new, you know, I, 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 I you know, I, I was reminded uh, early on of the awesome chat podcast, or, you know, a lot of times when I talk to him, there's some guy named John that started coming up to myself and Missy, and we were answered all these questions, and I'll, I'll answer anybody's questions, and, and, and I'll, I'll talk to somebody at PodCamp, and I'll just be like, I don't know what the heck they're going to do, you know, um, you know, I don't, they don't seem to get anything, I, you know, uh, uh, you know, very judgmental of me, I know, Uh you know, I'll never see that person again. They won't be back at pot camp. I, I'm never going to know a thing. Turns out that guy turned out to be a jagoff. Uh, so, and he's doing a blog, and we've been helping him with some video things here and there. And uh, and he's doing a awesome, awesome thing over there at yajagoff.com and, and, and really creating a community. And it did some really great charity work and, and everything. It's just, it's really fantastic. Yeah, again, you never know. And then there's somebody else that I sat at, at, at dinner uh, after after a pod camp and explained, you didn't do this, you take this, you, you take this video and you do this part. And, and, then, and then I haven't heard anything since, you know. Uh, so then that connects to everything else. Are you ready to do something? And maybe this is a, a this is the place where you'll be inspired to do something. Maybe this is a place where something will actually click, you know, if you have a passing interest in this and you have a message, you have a voice that you want to get out. Uh, you know, it's not just podcasting, uh, you know, the name. We actually thought about re rebranding it a couple years ago, but it's just like, no, PodCamp's PodCamp. PodCamp's going to PodCamp. PodCamp's going to camp. You know what I mean? Uh, so, so there's that. Uh, other than that, again, make new friends. Uh, 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 and it's always a really cool concept, and I'm really glad that the co-founders have, have come to uh, kind of celebrate this 10th, 10th anniversary. Chris Brogan, of course, one of the co co-founders of the original uh, pod camps, which, which was always like, and I guess he's kind of a big deal these days, but he was always a big deal to us early on. That uh, I forget what company he was working for at the time, and I always heard about him, and uh, and that he kind of, again the guy that came to our event, and he's very down to earth, and uh, and 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 BSs with us, and there's a really uh, a funky video from PodCamp One that we did uh, that uh, that he, that he's a part of, and it's it's pretty ridiculous, and again he got to play with us and our our weird sense of humor that's probably mellowed out here over the last several years for the Wrestling Mayhem show, uh, but. If you want to look at some PodCamp Mayhem show, go search for that. You'll find all the PodCamp One stuff and uh, and uh, even some Boot Camp, which was a kind of experimental thing that the, the guys did before I was involved with the, with the planning, at least. Um, but uh, but and, and 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 I mentioned that I'm a, a, a you know one of the kind of co-organizers for this. I want to make clear I don't organize anything except for the video side. I, I've gotten I kind of got thrown into some stuff here in the last minute, um, go, leading into this podcast Pittsburgh X. But I still kind of go as with an observer's mind. You know, I'm there. I'm filming. I'm I'm I'm, I'm trying to answer questions as much as I can. But uh, I, I think I would have been doing that anyways if I wasn't part of the organization committee and really it's just i'm the sounding board of uh uh, uh, uh let's keep this pure man uh i want to make sure PodCamp pittsburgh doesn't kind of go off the rails of what it's supposed to be as new people come in and have these new ideas and be like that's a great idea it's not PodCamp. go to a different conference <laughs> sometimes my response is something like that so um, so just sharing some thoughts. What do you think? PodCamp Pittsburgh. Will I see you at PodCamp Pittsburgh? If you're going to PodCamp Pittsburgh, 
Um, and no, you don't have to say a session that I'm involved in. Please don't. I think there's plenty of better sessions than what I'm going to be involved in this year. Uh, but no, what session are you looking forward to? Who who's speaking? Do you are you looking forward to? Let me know on uh, on Twitter at Sorgatron uh, in the comments wherever you find this video or audio. Uh, and and yeah, I want to hear from you. What do you think of, of uh, the sessions of PodCamp? You can check those out. The sessions are listed at PodCampPittsburgh.com. Register. See you Friday night at the meet and greet at Wiggle Whiskey in the strip and we'll see you next time this show is a member of the sorgatron media podcast network find out more at sorgatronmedia.com